Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Nurul Alia Farina binti Shamsidin. My metric number 1201072. And today I want to present about my assignment 1. It is the evaluation of the built environment. Firstly, I want to explain about Surah Ar-Rum verse 21. The translation is, And of his signs is that he creates for you from your self-made that you may find tranquility in them. And he placed between you affection and mercy. Indeed, in that are signs for a people who give thought. So from this ayah, Allah said that he creates the wife to be happy to live with a man, which is the husband. And also, feeling of the love and compassion will exist between them. It is clear that love and compassion are the key and should be the highlight in the family institution. Through that, the upbringing given by the husband or father can shape the personalities of their wife and children. So it's all start from home. Good planning will produce the perfect family. It is related to the concept of total planning doctrine, a contain a three principle, which is the relationship uh, between the man and creator, the relationship between man and environment, and also the relationship between man and man. So for this one is my side plan for my house. And this one is ground floor plan and the first floor plan of my house. So I will go to the, to the first principle which is the relationship between the man and creator. Firstly, respect for knowledge and conscience of the creator. Uh, for around my house, it has a school and mosque which is around 150 meters from my house. For the school, it is the Islamic religious school and for the mosque that uh, people are able to perform the prayer together and also to get to gain the knowledge. In my house, it also has the bookshelf in uh, bedroom 2 and bedroom 3. It has a uh, religious book, uh, magazine and also the novel. For the windows around my house, it only have at the living area, kitchen and the bedroom that allow to the natural lighting from outside and also for the people on see through the outside. For my house, there's no provided the prayer room. So we, uh, we always perform the prayer together in the living area. And also for the every room, uh, we also have a space to perform the prayer individually. For the qibla uh, in my house that is not facing to the toilet. So secondly is the justice which is the surround uh, study area. We usually uh, use living area and bedroom tree to study. Uh, for the living area, it is not uh, suitable when the guests come to our house. So uh, we use bedroom tree uh, for more comfortable to study because it only have the uh, study table there in our house. So for the bedroom, uh, we have the parents' bedroom and separated. Uh, between a uh, bedroom uh, for son and daughter and for the living area we always uh, use the area together with family members and for the rules uh, my father gives the rules that we have to go back home before 6 p.m next uh, thirdly is the compassion for the arrangement of the housing area that uh, the residential is considered the fact for, uh, to individual and the society and also the environment to allow people to do the individual thing, uh, society, social, and also the preserve the nature. And uh, for my house, that uh, we put uh, the frame uh, with the name of God and uh, also the zikr to enhance the remembrance of God. For the tree, uh, we uh, enough uh, we have the enough space uh, at living area and also the dining area to the guests. But we do not provide, uh, we do not provide the guest room in our house. And then, uh, partly the uh, trustworthy and the credibility among the family members, we always respect each other, uh, and trust each other, and uh, use uh, expert, uh, use the expertise from uh, ourselves to solve the thing. For example, for my brother, that uh, he have expertise in IT. So uh, if we have the problem with the laptop or other uh, gadget, we will refer to him. For around my neighborhood, that uh, they always discuss, discuss between the resi residents to get the better environment. For the uh, 
firstly the unity that among uh, family members we always discuss resolve the problem which is uh, in uh, living area and also the dining area for the neighborhood context that we also recite uh, the uh, Yasin recitation uh, every weekend house to the house for the next principle is the relationship between the man and environment for the cleanliness and beauty in my house uh, my mother always ensure us to uh, keep the cleanliness outside and inside the house we also put the aloe vera tree and fragrance inside the house will have the nice view and smell. And then uh, for the economy and effective use of resources, we'll always uh, avoid, uh, my parents always uh, remind us to avoid using too much water. And also we reuse the water from the fish to, uh, to the plants as the organic fertilizer. And also we provide the, uh, we also min mi maximize the minimum space in front of the house for gardening. Next, for the pre preservation of the environment and sustainable natural resources, we use timber in our house, which is for the staircase, um, door and hanging racks that um, also for the small gardening area that uh, we plant flower and the vegetable. So for the vegetable, uh, sometimes we use to uh, our uh, our dishes, uh, some uh, such as the turmeric and uh, limo product leaves. Next is the uh, relationship between the man and man. Firstly, the respecting uh, privacy and the by deviation of the space that we use curtain. Uh, use uh, we use curtain to separate between the public and the private area. For example, in my house, that from entrance, people may see directly the kitchen, which is the private area. So the existence of the kitchen, it can make uh, the area more privacy. Uh, next is the value of encouraging the interaction and equipment. So for, my, for the recreation area, around 150 meters from my house, that we have a badminton court, a football field, and also the playground and uh, around 550 meter from my house that the nearest river uh, that people can fish in there and also can communicate each other there next is the peace and security among the uh, in in the in my house that uh, we have a steel grill at door and also the window that to uh, give the security of my house and also uh, at night that we have uh, we all, we must unlock the door to uh safe to keep our safe uh, home safe. And for the neighborhood context, for the peace, we also exchange the food between the neighbors, uh, especially during Ramadan. Um, and for the security, uh, in our area that not provided the security guard, so our most community member, uh, are responsible for keeping the residential uh safe. Next. Respecting the right of the individual. Among the family members, we have to ask the permission between family members even we live in the same house because we respect each other's style. So, in the neighborhood context, that we also uh, respect to other people's decisions, especially during the meeting. And also, we implement the right for the resident uh, and also for the community members uh, in our area that they also hold the meeting between community members uh, once a month that uh, we have to uh, use the space that provided only. So next uh, is the cooperation, sensitivity and the mutual respect. Among the family members, we always, uh, we always uh, help each other in doing housework such as uh, washing the car, sweeping the floor and cooking the meal. And also for the neighborhood context, uh, we all, uh, we also uh, always uh, working together if they have uh, any events in our housing area. So, and also for the sensitivity, uh, for the azan and uh, absolutely for the Muslim, uh, to perform the prayer, in uh, my housing area that uh, seventy hundred percent population of the residential are the Muslim, and also it have some uh, others religion uh, such as Buddhist and uh, Hinduism. Uh, so we also uh, respect them uh, to their religion. And also between the generation, 
the old people and the youngest generation, we also uh, respect them. For the consultation, for the consultation term, that among the family members, we always, uh, we also always, uh, consult with the parents to the best decision. Uh, for example, before I, uh, before I uh, entered to UC, uh, we also uh, discuss for the course that uh, I want to uh, continue in uh, the university. So the conclusion of uh, of all of this um, principle. So uh, if you can see through the table that I uh, I've got uh, twenty five over twenty six. So from this table, the conclusion that I uh, made that the um this this is the all the principles are implement in the house except the justice in the relationship between the man and creator principle. So from the table, we are able to see that the house not in line on the point in the concept of total planning doctrine. So the justice point are missed in the relationship between man and creator. So from the aspect right foot and appropriate space because uh, we doesn't have the appropriate space to study to relate to al fatiha that it is not fully applied to it in al ahkam or the law term. So from that we have to implement the justice in the house because it's related to our creator. So from that we also can uh, enhance the uh, the remembrance of God. I think that's all from me. Thank you.